Well, the French prime minister also said that skiing stations, bars and restaurants will remain shut. For a look at how some in the food industry are trying to stay afloat, we can speak to a reporter, James Andre, at a restaurant in Paris's 12th arrondissement. Uh, James, good morning to you. If we look behind you, we can see the chairs stacked in the restaurant. The doors are blocked by a table and it appears that there's no reopening in sight anytime soon. Yes, absolutely. As you can see, the owner of this restaurant behind me, uh, called Youssef, has put a table across the door. He can't let customers in, but what he is offering is a bit of coffee, because there is a market on this street here. And uh, indeed, he says he opens on market days, but he does say he has lost uh, way in excess of 75% of his turnover. And it is the same for most restaurants in Paris. And we are faced, and this is uh, Bruno Le Maire, who uh, gave this information with a potential wave of... Uh, of restaurants and bars shutting in 2021, potentially destruction of jobs uh, to go with that. So indeed the situation is dire for the 100, 168,000 French restaurants. Some unions say that in excess of 75% of those restaurants are now on the brink of collapse. So it is a, a very, very dire, dire situation indeed uh, for bars and restaurants in France. And Youssef earlier was to, on was telling me, well, Obviously, he did expect the prime minister to say that restaurants wouldn't be able to reopen on the 20th of January, as it had been stated earlier. But he did say it is still depressing uh, to hear it and to not have an actual reopening date in view, since the prime minister simply said that there would be no reopening of bars and restaurants before mid-February. Uh, James, you mentioned there that business is down uh, three quarters. Uh, how can restaurants, how can bars survive such a dramatic drop in business? Well, first, because they are being helped by the French state. And indeed, Jean Castex said this as well as Bruno Le Maire, the French state will carry on, uh, well, giving money, helping out these businesses so they can survive. There are three main tools at this stage. One is uh, the ability for the state to loan money uh, with no interest. There is also the fact that for staff, uh, the French state is paying unemployment benefit, partial unemployment benefits uh, for them to stay at home and be paid by the state rather than uh, their employers. This is for all these sectors which are being shut down uh, by order of uh, the state itself. And then there is a specific help for restaurants and bars. Uh, they are getting uh, either 20% of uh, their 2019 uh, turnover as a handout or 10,000 euros if that is more than uh, their than 20% of their turnout uh, monthly turnout in 2019 so that's the situation obviously they're being helped by the state the situation is very difficult and then of course they are also trying to do takeaway selling over the counter like here but of course that doesn't make up for the losses all right thank you very much james james andre reporting from paris